really the motivation the applicant wants to fix her zoning, hopefully to obtain a permit to expand the structure that's on the property. In addition to that, permit is also a potential property swap with her neighbor to the northeast, Ms. Fuller. Uh, at this time, the application involves both Ms. West and Ms. Fuller. And the reason the Planning Commission tabled it is because one of those applicants, Ms. Fuller, is really not completely understanding of the application right now. Um, since that time, we've uh, communicated with Ms. Fuller. We've arranged for a meeting for us to meet at her property tomorrow at 1230 in an attempt to try to help her understand what's going on and make sure she understands before we move forward uh, in a different manner. So the case has been advertised. From a staff standpoint, I'd like to at least try one more time to meet with Ms. Fuller and help her understand what's going on uh, before it comes to the commission. If the meeting goes well, then I think it will be ready for action tomorrow, and, and the recommendation has been for approval. Uh, if it does not go well, then uh, most likely what we'll do is ask you all to table it, and we'll re-advertise with just Ms. West and move forward with just her property and not Ms. West and Ms. Fuller. So, um, that's the current status, and I'll be able to update you tomorrow uh, after we have that meeting. But I think it's ready for consideration if Ms. Fuller is going to be ready to move forward. Any questions? If, if the meeting goes well tomorrow and she's ready to move forward, do we still need to have this on our agenda before the Planning Commission has had a chance to vote on it? That is that is up to y'all. We could take it back to the Planning Commission, or, we, or you could be you could move forward with it. That's really your preference. Okay. But Jason, it was my understanding at the meeting that they wanted them to come back to them after she should get further understanding. Yeah. I think that they would, I think they would enjoy an opportunity to look at this, but I think they would understand if the applicant, if you didn't want to make them wait another 30 days for them to do that. I mean, we've, we've tried, with, and I'd like to at least try one time before y'all vote on it to see if we can't get this ready but certainly I don't mind waiting. I know Miss West is not in a hurry. I know she doesn't mind waiting. But I at least wanted to make one attempt to try to, to do it before we made her wait another 30 days for it to be decided. I know that was a request that we needed to do that. Okay. Jason, will there be notes in the file so if, this, if a question on this rezoning comes up 10 years down the road that, that we can support it and if without creating a spot zoning issue to say basically we're going in correcting a, a default in the system. And yes, sir. Yes, sir. And I, I've, I really tried to be detailed about that in the report. So hopefully whoever's here, you know, 10 years down the road, if it's someone different, then they'll they'll be able to know that from our own work and our research. Okay. Part of those concerns we're meeting, I've actually had a chance to meet PCA, the mill. They were probably the most concerned about this case. Uh, we think we, 